YouTube, what is up? I'm back at you with another little update video in my uh, office. It's still a mess, but it's getting a little better. I'm going to grab some paint tomorrow and I'm going to start painting it. Um, got a little video for you. Um, it's on the 35th anniversary belt buckle set. Uh, let me show you the belt buckle. Just put it in a baggie. It says 1968 to 1983, 15th anniversary, oh, 15th birthday. Hot Wheels, really cool. Um, I had gotten this about a year ago with this Porsche that was available in the set. And this long gone, long shot back then. Both minty. And I needed the Camaro, and it came carded, and I opened them because somebody cut out a little square and took out the Camaro. So, um, this last show that I went to where I met James Shear, um, somebody was selling this for like five bucks, and I was like, okay, I gotta have it. I've been wanting it. It's a good fill of piece. It's not mint, but it's it's okay. Well, anyways, I had uh, recently posted on Facebook a couple things I had for trade, well, for sale. And a buddy of mine, Rick, on my Facebook group said, um, Hey, I know you're looking to sell things, but what, you know, is there any way we can uh, work that Camaro in that you've been wanting? And he had a mint one. Uh, well, I guess two little flea bites in the roof, but I can deal with that. To me, it's mint. I'm never getting rid of it. Love it. Well, he offered to trade that to me for the uh, Datsun, um, Datsun, whatever, the Datsun RLC one. And I had gotten it at the uh, car show where I met James for a good deal. And I was like, you know what? Sounds good. And he even offered to pay for the shipping. So I was like, sweet, dude. Thanks. And it came in the mail, and it came in this nice little box, and then he put it in this little box, which was pretty cool, man. Never seen these before, and he had it all wrapped in tissue paper. Well, now I can show you guys a very mint one. This thing is beautiful. That's one little flea bite there, two little flea bites. I could always just put black magic marker, and I'll probably, you know... You'd never know, but I'm just going to leave it like it is. This thing is gorgeous. Rolls nice. Oh, yeah. Very happy to add this to my collection. So, that was right there. The 35th anniversary belt buckle set. I don't know if a lot of you guys know about it. I'm sure you guys do. Um, so, I was very happy to add that to the collection. If anybody's interested in this... Please let me know because I will trade it off. Um, I really do like it, but I have a mint one now and all I need is one. So if somebody else is looking for this, this is up for trade. If you guys are interested, comment below. Let me know what you got. I really would like um, just anything old, black walls um, or original real writers. Uh, Another thing is, uh, what else? Um, oh, my wife got this for me today. I hot lobby to go in my man cave to go on my desk. I'm going to go get my desk tomorrow. It's a Route 66 lamp. And then on the, the lampshade is a um, mat. So it's pretty cool. She got that Hobby Lobby for like 20 bucks. It was originally like $45. So she got a great deal on that. So I was like, thanks, babe. Um, just got back from my brother-in-law's wedding. I was in Ohio. Um, Marty France, um, this week I will get the track set up. I got the, uh, box already. I just need to, um, get some money. Um, but I'll, I, I should have it by Friday. And then, um, go, go daddy. I watched your video. Dude, don't sweat it. I mean, I, I, sometimes I get to let things get to me too. With people thumbs down in and, you know, can't, they're not patient. They, they, they gotta have it right then and there. It's like, dude, you know, like you said, we have lives. Um, so, um, but anyways, we love your videos. Keep them up. Um, so don't stop making videos. Um, and then, I'm gonna do a little cracking. I was gonna sell this, but I really don't need the money that bad. 
and I only needed him the money for um, more cases because I, you know, I showed you in my last video when I did the whole wall. Well, um, I did sell a lot, so I can probably get about three, four cases. So I'm coming along good. Um, but I got this thunder roller, and as you all know, it's one of my favorite castings. And uh, I'm gonna crack it. Oh, that came out right out there. Look at that. This thing is sweet. This will be going in the case next to my other Thunder Rollers. There you go. They did, they did a really good job on this. Black and pink. I like pink. Not just because I like, because I have daughters. It's just, I really do like pink. There ain't nothing wrong with it, especially when it comes to a Hot Wheel. Thing is tight. Look how shiny that is. Man, top graphics. I know you guys have all seen this, but not very many people open their cars. Real Rider tires. I mean, they did a great job on this. This thing is sweet. So, yeah, I'm happy to have that. Very happy to have that. And then, uh, what else? I got anything else going on for you? Oh, hang on. Let me show you something cool. I was in Cincinnati over the week. And um, I, uh, for my brother-in-law's wedding, and um, they have Frisch's Big Boy, and I love Frisch's Big Boy. So we went there for breakfast the day after the wedding, and um, I saw this little guy. He's a little bank, so he'll be going on one of my shelves in my man cave. It reminds me of Ohio. My wife's from Ohio, so she thought it was cute. Five bucks, and it's a uh, piggy bank. He's got that little slot in his head. So I thought that was cool. And then I bought a, uh, went to this place called Jungle Gyms and they have a ton, a ton of hot sauce. So I bought the ghost pepper uh, hot sauce and me and my brother-in-law tried it. And um, it was hot, very hot. And then I tried to put it on the plane and they said it was, it was too many ounces. So I had to throw it away. So then my wife felt bad and while we were in the, uh, in the uh, airport after we went to security, you could buy another thing of hot sauce while you're there. So why do they all not allow it when you go through the security, but they allow you to get it and then bring it on the plane once you go through security. This is called a fighting cock. It's got uh, Kentucky bourbon. It's actually a barbecue sauce for it. They say it's the second hottest sauce that they had there. And um, on the back of it, it says all kinds of stuff. And it's, I, I read reviews on it that it's excellent but real hot. So I was happy to get that. Alright guys, uh, what else do I got going on? Um, not much. I guess I'm going to try to paint this week. I start my uh, business on Monday, um, but I got to go to work with the guy Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So technically, I, I guess I start on my route Thursday. Um, and then I'm going to try to sell some more stuff because I really want to get this man cave going. Um, and uh, But anyways... Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening to me blab. Um, thanks for all the support once again. Peace.